Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick9G. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to be talking about I Love Lucy. More specifically, I'm going to be revealing the identity of this woman that you may have seen on I Love Lucy. Now, when I tell you who she is, you're going to be, oh my goodness, was this really true? How did I not know this the entire time? Now, let's first talk about which episode I am referring to, if you want to guess. It's from season two, episode four. It's called The Handcuffs. Personally, it's one of my top five favorite episodes of season two. It's so good, I really like it. Essentially, Lucy decides to be with Ricky, and so she snaps a pair of handcuffs, uh, one on her hand, one on Ricky's hand, so that they cannot be quote unquote separated. Of course, Ricky gets super upset at this, and they find that they can't get these handcuffs off. They even have to struggle trying to figure out how to sleep because the handcuffs is making it really difficult to see how they would lay together on the bed and so forth, and it was really funny. Now, they got a locksmith to come, but he couldn't figure it out, and Ricky had a show to do, so they had the locksmith meet them at the show, and they were tied together, and then they had the MC, the person who was essentially running the television show that Ricky was on and asking him questions. She was like the announcer for the show, as I mentioned, the MC. Now, who is this woman? They don't really give her her name when you're watching this. In fact, she's billed as just the MC, and that's it, right? No, no name or anything like that. Her name was Viola Vaughn. Now, from her name, you probably still won't know who she is, but when I tell you what connection she has to another person, you're gonna go, oh, no way. She actually was married to someone who was on this show a lot. Someone who was on this show actually 11 times appeared on I Love Lucy. You may have seen him. I won't go through all of his appearances. I made videos on him. Maybe I'll make more in the future. His name was Frank Nelson. Yes, you know who I'm talking about, right? The guy who played Dickie Davis, then Freddie Fillmore, Sergeant Nelson in this one where he's the cop in the episode Ricky and Fred are TV fans. I mean, he was so iconic. He was so unique. Now, this wasn't his first wife. This was his second wife after his divorce. They were married from 1970 to up until his death in 1986. Now, what's interesting is that they got married in 1970, but they never met on I Love Lucy, meaning they were never in the same episode, they were never on screen on the show, but later on in 1970, two decades after I Love Lucy, they got married. And so her identity has been pretty much null. I mean, no one has known about her. I mean, yes, she was an actress, she was also a singer and so forth, but the connection between her and Frank Nelson was never really apparent, something that I never knew. I wouldn't have find out who she was do a little bit of digging and when I found out I said I have to tell my audience because this is the stuff they like to see and the stuff they like to hear. Let me know what do you think of this episode the handcuffs and the episode Ricky and Fred are TV fans two of my favorites of season two and isn't that cool how two of these amazing hilarious episodes are connected between these two people who were married and essentially you never knew. I never knew and I'm so happy to bring this all to you. Let me know your thoughts down below. Are you surprised about this? And let me know what you think about each of them as well. We'll see you all next time. And don't forget, everyone, be hopeful. Thank you so much to all my supporters, especially my Diamond Tier patrons. Jerry D, Citizen Kane 359, Jennifer P, David D, Kevin K, Sally Ann, and Vito L. If you want to be on this list, make sure to check out my Patreon description in the link below. Thank you so much again.